Big news as Poet announces a design win in collaboration with Foxconn Interconnect Technologies, a subsidiary of Foxconn, which is the world's leading electronics manufacturer. Here to discuss the news about this announcement is Raju Kankapati, Poet's Senior VP of Product Management and GM of North America. Raju, you must be feeling really good about this announcement. Hi, Adrian. Yes, uh, this is just amazing news for everyone that's involved with Poet. I mean, Foxconn is probably the biggest logo that we have added to our customer list. Foxconn Interconnect Technologies, also known as FIT, is a huge player in the data center, mobile computing, and IoT devices. So we are super excited to be collaborating with them. And, you know, before we get into the technical merits of this collaboration, tell us what kind of validation working with Foxconn brings to Poet. So usually companies the size of FIT spend a lot of time analyzing various technologies before making a decision on which way to move forward. A market leader like Foxconn deciding to use our technology is a huge boost for us and an excellent validation of what we have been pitching as our differentiation. For us, this is like jumping to a higher orbital and getting a step closer to our vision of bringing the semiconductorization uh, of photonics process to the industry at large. And, and like many customer relationships Poet has, this has been a long time in the making, but it also accelerated after Poet's success at the OFC conference in March. Isn't that correct? Yes, we've been in discussions for several months to identify the right project where we can start an engagement. At OFC, we were able to show a live demonstration of our silicon platform using indium phosphide-based EML lasers for 400 gig and 800 gig applications. I mean, the size of the chip, the level of integration, and the performance were just outstanding. The most attractive part of the demo was that it can be scaled to 1.60 and 3.2 T-speeds with identical module design and assembly process. This just accelerated the decision-making process and helped us to seal the deal. And, you know, now that the deal is sealed, what exactly will Poet and FIT be collaborating on and what does it mean uh, for the AI industry? So Poet powers AI with our optical engines and those engines are the foundation of the work we're doing with FIT. While I cannot go into the details of the exact products we'll be working together on, I can say that we will collaborate on developing 800 gig and 1.60 optical transceiver modules that address the demands of the AI industry. And how long do you anticipate it will take to complete all of the development work? So one of the key benefits of our optical interposer platform is hybrid integration. It provides the flexibility to use best of breed components without being limited to one material type. What this means is that we will be incorporating some of the components preferred by the customer onto our platform. So we expect the development work to take about six to nine months, followed by customer design activity, which can take another six to nine months. Of course, some of this work will be done in parallel as both parties are motivated to expedite the timeline as much as possible. So we can expect that in the second half of 2025, we'll have a completed solution ready for commercial deployment. Which, is, which will be monumental for Poet and the industry, given the size of FIT's existing customer base. And it's not only uh, the customer base that's growing, so are the audience for Poet. Uh, the company has gained a lot of new followers in recent weeks. Visit Poet's website and review other content to get caught up on the story that Raju and all the talented engineers are writing. Raju, we'll check back with you very soon, I'm sure. Congratulations again on this announcement and good luck with the next steps. Thanks, Adrian. We'll talk to you soon.